In this video I'm going to show you how to play a polska from southern Sweden. So this dance tune has a very beautiful melody but I also added some double stops making it a, a beautiful mandolin arrangement. And a double stop is when you, you have a melody note like this but then you also are adding uh, another note So let us first have a listen to my performance of this tune. It's a mandolin and guitar arrangement. It sounds like this. Yeah, this Polska is after a fiddler called Juringius, and it's a very popular tune in this part of the world. At every fiddle jam session you can hear this tune being played. And yeah, let me show how you can play it. Mandolinsecrets.com My name is Magnus, and I hope my videos can make you a better and more inspired mandolin player. I have new videos like this coming out every week, so please subscribe if you're new at a channel. And uh, this is uh, part of my ebook, The Nordic Folk Mandolin 10 Traditional Tunes. This is a series of videos showing you the, this very exciting music from Scandinavia. So, this polska is all in the key of B minor meaning we're using the B minor scale. It looks like this. Starting on the B note with the first finger on the A string. On the B part where also I'm adding the double stop that would also include some notes on the D string. But this is a very good starting point. We play the B minor scale again. And descending. And I really recommend you follow the, um, this tutorial with the sheet music that is in the ebook. And it, there is all the. It's standard notation, it's mandolin tabs, it's the fingerings, it's a picking direction and all that. And uh, the first two bars, the slang polska is in 3-4 time. So the beat is like 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Like a slow kind of 3-4 time. And the melody is starting on the... F sharp up here, playing this rhythm. I play the two first bars. One, two, three. I play the A part for you slowly once without the double stops. So you can see how I'm doing that. One, two, three.
we're starting on the F sharp up here on the E string. Playing the two first bars only, sounds like this. And the right hand is here playing this little pattern. Down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 down. There is actually different ways to do the, the picking directions for this kind of tune, but for now I'm using this. Down, up, down, down. A lot of down strokes. One, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, the two first bars slowly. One, two, three. Then we're playing a sequence of that, starting from the E note. Four bars together. One, two, three. One thing I can point out, in the first bar, when you're playing the F sharp, you want to press down the, even the B note with the first finger. You can do it in little different ways, but find a way that feels good for you, so you can press down both strings at the same time. And the, the bar 5 and 6 of the A part sounds like this. I'm also doing a hammer on there. I'm hammering on this. We do the A part without the double stops. One, two, three. Again. So that's the way I want you to, to learn it. First only the single note and then you add the double stops. And the double stop is uh, really following the chords. So for the first bar, it's this B minor chord. We're adding the D open D string, so it becomes and then a E minor and then the A D this So take a close look when I'm playing it with the double stops and also refer to the tabs. One, two, three. We go on with the B part. The melody, this is following the same rhythmic pattern. One, two, three, one, two, three. We're starting on the C sharp. Fourth fret of the A string. So here the melody actually um, consists of a double stop. Same phrase going twice. And 
then. So that is actually the same uh, ending as the A part. Do that part together. One, two, three. That is the whole um, whole tune. And I always encourage you to play along with a metronome. I'm setting the metronome to 70 beats per minute. Still a practice tempo. But uh, for the performance or for a dance session you want to go maybe to 90 up to 100 beats per minute. You play both A and B part. With double stops, if you would like to do that, single notes, if you prefer that. One, two, three. If you paid attention to my performance video and uh, to the sheet music, you can also see I like to add some thrills in there. For example, um, in this. Pretty much when I hit the. when I go to this. Uh, F sharp, I like to. And that is a hammer on and a pull off. I play it so you can see how it sounds when using the thrills and the ornaments. So that's something you can experiment with, adding this. Yeah, I think that's it for today. And uh, go to my website, mandolinsecrets.com. You can find the ebook. And uh, there is also another Slang Polska using the same kind of rhythm like this in the, in the ebook. Maybe you heard it. That one, you see it's the same rhythm, it's one, two, three, one, two, three.
And as always, if you like this video lesson, please share it with a friend and hit the like button. I'm also very happy if you leave a comment below. It's always uh, nice for me to hear from people picking up the message that I send out. And until next time, have a good time and happy picking. Bye.